There is actually, I think there is a couple more than just one. And it feels like mackerel because there is some, this electricity in the air and in the line. It feels completely different than anything else. All right, welcome to Fishing with Jaska. On this episode, we are fishing on Macville. So, a little bit about the equipment. This is it. One Macville hackle. So there's a weight. And then when I'm starting to unravel this, there is a hooks. And there's nothing else on the hooks than just a little red dot of paint. And this is actually plenty. I'm gonna I'm gonna personally use uh, another type of mackerel hackle. So there is a hooks, and then there's a little bit of red rubber plastic hose on the hook, and nothing else. There has been, of course, these uh, silver wings, but the fish has kind of ripped them off already when I was testing it. So this is what we do today. Let's see how it goes. A little bit about the, where you can find the mackerel. So usually mackerel is easy to find close to the shore. So you can cast or uh, fish it straight from the land. You don't even in a boat. And uh, they are really not that picky. You can use anything silverish, red. Red works really well and silver. And uh, if you're uh, using a boat and you have a sonar, and you will, uh, let's say you have a 30 meters of water or 40 meters of water, then you will see some kind of uh, school of fish in 15 meters going really fast. That's usually mackerel. And when you are fishing them, and if you are using this kind of same kind of system as I do like this, or then you are hooking up something on your rod where it's multiple hooks, if you feel there is some one fish, just let it be there a bit, because usually when one mackerel is biting on the hook and then it goes round like in a carousel there, the other fishes are as well taking on the bait. So a little bit patience, patience goes a long way. Yep, now we are looking for a mackerel in the sonar. Can we find any? Yep, in a 50 meters. There it is. Can you stop? All right, I have this kind of setup. A weight, <laughs> a weight, two lures, and then this kind of uh, series of hooks with the white, uh, red rubber. And now I'm gonna lower it. Like this, maybe five meter first, then jigging a little bit. Seeing if there is anything, okay. Rita is having a fish. So now I just lower my lure and I start fishing and here we are now we have a fish on and uh, there is actually I think there is a couple more than just one and it feels like mackerel because there is some, this electricity in the air and in the line it feels completely different than anything else can you help me a bit Rita? Yeah, there's a plenty of mackerel here and Rita will hold this rod and I'm gonna pull these fishes up. One got loose. Well, that's life. And three nice mackerels. So one 
here. Oh, one more is loose as well. And there. Full line, full line. So, how is it going? It's going a little bit too well. Bucket full of mackerel. And we're definitely gonna try to get some more. Okay, day. and one more thing. When we are fishing for mackerel, we are having a bucket with the seawater. We are making small cuts here on the mackerels, on the tails, and then we are opening the gills. And then we are putting them on a cold seawater. It's really important to bleed them fast. It's like same thing with the bigger tuna, so the meat will be really good. The meat will be absolutely delicious. All right, uh, let's get uh, here. Small coal fish. And in the end is lovely mackerel. So this coal fish goes back to freedom. And this Mackerel will meet the maker. Just a lovely fish. Rita will of course handle this. There. Oh, now there was a more mackerel, but instantly lose. Yep. All right, so that was it. I think we are done. This video was meant to be a shorter one and uh, we got 16 plus mackerels. We got actually lost the count in 16. We have a cooling box here and we have a cooling clamp and all the mackerel is there because uh, they are ten tending to go spoiled really fast so it's important we are transporting them in a cool box and uh, thanks for watching the video it was uh, uh, nice to make this one again all these kind of videos again and uh, if you did like the video, please like the video, write me a comment and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. So, see you next one. Bye bye and have a good day. How do you feel about the north wind? It's cold. So, at least we got a, a lot of fish. Oh yeah, we did. Yes. Yeah, we did it. Yeah, it's kind of good you didn't lapse me with that one. <laughs> no, no intentions. No lapsing with knives. Alright. Not even like this. Off we go. Off we go. Home for dinner. <laughs>